Hey everyone, it's Eric here from My525XL. Today is Friday, October 11th. Rolling into the uh, long weekend for Thanksgiving here in Canada. Uh, just giving you a quick update on the tank. <clears throat> I just turned the lights on and noticed that somebody has tipped over my Space Invader, so I'm going to have to remount that guy. Um, also noticing that I've got a resurfacing of the algae on the sand bed again, so getting a little frustrated with that. Uh, I need to get that under a microscope, and I will. I don't think I'll get it on this video, but I'll do another short one this weekend, see if I can get some opinions on this stuff. Um, just drive me batty. I can see why people get so frustrated. Um, other than that, the corals really aren't out yet because the lights just went on. I kept them off this morning, so it's about two o'clock right now or two thirty. You can see the uh, torch isn't out yet either. So, um, yeah, just trying to get through this bloody algae issue. Um, and my GHA is back, as you can see in the background there. So, I need to do some parameter reading, see what the phosphate is at. I've got a bag of GFO in the sump going. Uh, yeah, I just can't seem to recover. I don't know. One little blip a few months ago, and I'm still trying to recover. Honest to God. But anyway, par for the course. I don't give up, so I'm just going to keep pushing forward and uh, see how we do. On the other side, <laughs> lacking some maintenance here this week on the uh, seahorse tank. As you can see, I got some cleanup to do here. It's really, it's amazing how hard this is to get off once the snail goes around and eats it. Um, the other stuff I can actually rub off. You see, I don't know if that's visible or not, but where the snail's been, it does not come off. It's almost like, I don't know, sticky. Anyway, uh, the seahorse in there, she, he or she is doing fine. Um, frostbite, Oslaris is doing great. The, uh, I can't see him right now, but the arrow crab is still in there. I have not noticed hardly any, uh, Bristle worm, so he's definitely full. Um, but everything else in here is doing really well. I'm really impressed with, again, I wish I had a clearer glass. The corals in here have so much more color, and these are the same corals than in my other tank, in the bigger tank. <clears throat> um, even the Duncans, uh, just more vibrant. Um, and I don't, <laughs> I don't do readings on this tank at all. I just rely on... Uh, on the pH and I do salinity checks but other than that like I just I let it run so I don't know I don't know <laughs> kind of at a loss interesting though um, don't do a lot of care and feeding here and it just seems to flourish um, like even the 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 coral itself it seems to be thicker in the growth than the other one it's more slender and the polyp extensions on here are double what I see in the other tank anyway just dosing all for Ethan here. I think it's five mil a day, uh, and that's it. I'm not doing anything else. So interesting. Uh, I'll just keep going with it, whatever works, right? So back to this tank. Yeah, I'll have to do some work on it this weekend. Uh, I'm gonna get some readings in here. I'll probably post, today's Friday, so I'm probably gonna post this tomorrow by the time I get a break to do the readings and uh, see what we're looking at. Curious to see what the phosphate is, but I think um, some of the other posts were indicating that, you know, the GHA is probably sucking up the phosphate. That's why it's reading low, which is probably exactly right. So I'm probably going to increase my GFO and uh, see if I can get that back down to a respectable level. And then I've got to remount that Space Invader. Anyway, so that's it for me for today. Um, thank you very much for watching and subscribing. Always appreciate you guys. Uh, questions or comments leave them down below I know I've been kind of going around this topic now for a while so I don't I don't want you guys to get frustrated and have to repeat yourself so um, you know if you've already given me the suggestions I will work towards that but um, anyway hope you guys have a fantastic weekend uh, Thanksgiving weekend for those that are celebrating here and uh, until we chat again stay safe and happy reefing